Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Sandrock. Well yesterday's episode uh, was a little bit uh, rubbish for like thumbnails and things actually. It was it was kind of it, there wasn't much story to it. We were making a lot of progress on a lot of things all at once and this sometimes happens in this game. You'll, you'll have days where you've got all the story all the time. And you'll have days where where you're spending all your time doing workshop upgrades and uh, making awesome tower frames. I'm gonna get a picture of that in the daylight. Yes, that will totally not be the thumbnail for the previous episode. <laughs> but uh, yes, we are going to pick that up and we are going to hand it in so that I can actually start getting some more quests because I have no quests right now. We're just doing loads of commissions and things, which is fine. I'm at a point now where I can take four commissions a day and we can take um, commissions for things like petrified wooden sticks and boards. Uh, I was also in the middle of trying to upgrade my processor and yes, I do have the stuff for it, which means that I can start on the petrified wooden boards at the same time as the petrified wooden sticks which is very nice. So they're both commissions for Owen. So anything, anything that I lost with him, by not being able to do the sand carp thingy yesterday, which I was a bit disappointed by, I'll, I'll admit. Uh, but anything I lost by that, I'll easily be able to make up with uh, these. These are five star commissions for Owen as well. So uh, they are gonna be 30, like another 60 points with him just for that. Also Grace's soup pots are still sitting in behind so they're going to be done in about 20 minutes time so they'll be about the end of the day uh we've got a while on those anyway i think we've got another two days we've got eight days left on the ones for owen so yeah that's fine actually you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna just can those steel bars and i'm gonna start them on this completely unused civil, uh, civil furnace because why not I need to make chromium bars. I don't know how to make them. Also, we need to go get some more graphite today as well. All right, next job. Let's go and have a look at the commissions and see what I can take. Bloodstone cores, cast iron nails. Iron things aren't the best. I don't know how much rubber I've got left either for the pumping pipes. All right, I'm gonna take pumping pipes, bloodstone core. Oh no, okay. We're not going to take any of those because the others aren't ready. We could take sand rice and cantaloupe maybe for Zeke because I do have those. So it might be nice to do something for Zeke because that would be 30 points for Zeke. Which isn't something you always get. And if I go up to see Zeke as well, I can go buy a load of seeds because I'm really short on seeds right now. But I'm going to be alright for money. I, like, I literally try my best to get rid of all my money and it's like nope oh you know i still haven't read hicks's letter shall we read it because i just haven't read it so this came out of the time capsule remember and um it was hicks's um depiction of what his life was like in the cataclysm age i guess i don't know Calamity age. Uh, so anyway, if you're reading this under the light of the sun again and not still from the darkness, it's been 60 years since that event which some people are starting to call the day of calamity. In this time, human beings have begun to live in sadness, forgetting about the society we all came from. There are also those who do not live in depression, but have instead given up on their humanity. They are constantly fighting, forming gangs, hurting others, squandering whatever little resources others are able to get together. After that horrible event, it seems many have given up hope. But I still believe that we'll not be so easily defeated. When things were darkest, I risked travelling around the underground, searching for ruins of our civilization, and trying to help the people who were left. I made it my mission to build up humanity again. I'm leaving this container to be discovered by the people of the future. I hope by those under the sun, seeking to learn more about the people like me, who are now history. I hope this capsule can travel through time, and show that whatever happened, there was some warmth in those dark times. Is there any more? No, oh, I think that's it. That was pretty cool. 
So yeah, that was the, the little note that came along with the time capsule. Well, yeah, I'll keep that just for posterity, I think. Um, right, so we could do with putting together some of these relics. Uh, I could do with just putting them all in the in the relic bin, to be honest. The relic bin is going to get quite full of stuff quite soon, though. I tend to just keep relics in it until I can put them together, and then I'll either gift the relic to someone or I'll sell it on. So, you're a relic, you're a relic, you're a relic, you're a relic. A relic. I'm actually going to call this box scrap. I'm going to put all the scrap in it. Next time the uh, mysterious man comes along, I'm going to get some more boxes as well. Although I don't, ha I do have like six big boxes and I don't actually have them all full at the moment so I, what I could do with maybe doing is moving tailor and tailoring into a bigger box and maybe having miscellaneous in a bigger box so how many big boxes do I have three one you know what I'm gonna do just because it's nice to sometimes just I'm gonna put tailoring in there I'm going to take all the tailoring stuff out of here. And then that box can go away. So, all the leather. Cooking on medicine for alfalfa. Okay. Scrap is in quite a big box, um, so I don't know whether that will eventually need to be in a smaller box or something. But it's only, we're only going to get more stuff, aren't we? So I'll probably eventually need like a, a medicine and a cooked food box and things like that, but for now we're doing fine. I'm not even giving the meerkat those eggs anyway at the moment, so that's fine. I do need to keep bait on me. Woodstone rubber. Keeping the chromium out. The Akmal horn is probably a tailoring thing. Uh, woodstone rubber for that wood. Tailoring for that. Oh gosh. Make sure I'm not using the wrong tailoring bench. Okay, so now what I want to do is take up the tailoring bench and pop that back into my imagery. And then I've got books and misc. Um, which I think I do need to keep as a miscellaneous box anyway. That'll do for now. I don't want to spend like ages and ages and ages doing um, inventory sorting because I'll end up with like what I had before, like a, a, an episode of like 20 minutes long of just inventory sorts. Hmm. Can't fit this anywhere. I fit it. Oh, yeah, I can fit it in the corner. There's a lot of art here. I'm just ramming it all in at the moment just because it basically adds to my hit points really nicely. So at the moment, I've got an extra 691 hit points just from like various paintings and pieces of furniture. But what will need to happen is all these will need to come off the wall at some point. I need to really clear out my imagery, pull all of my decorations out, make myself like a bedroom, maybe take, you know, this uh, nice desert rose picture, for example. Oh, I need to fuel up my generator. Hang on. Uh, and then just take them into the bedroom and then maybe have like a dining room or a living room or something and take a load of pictures into there and just... And I'll put them down with the nice um, uh, home decoration thing. You know the one I mean, the home decoration uh, thing on my wheel, the edit home thing. Uh, because if I use that, then I can have a lot more control over how high up the wall I put the paintings. It's not going to be perfect, but it'll be a lot better than it was. All right, let's see. Are there any commissions that I can hand in at the moment? I don't think so. I think they're all being processed. 
I'm gonna go see Birdie Boy and get some more water, I think. Unless I've picked up dew in the meantime. I don't know. Oh, I did a little bit. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Probably still could do with Birdie Boy water, though. I've got one more bit of water after that plant being watered and I'm at 53% in the tap, which will last me a little bit. Oh, that's my clothing chest, is it? I see. I definitely need like a clothes and misc chest and then maybe also accessories. Yeah, I definitely think I'm going to get another set of three chests from Mysterious Man. And then I'll probably have like a three by three grid of chests somewhere. Just tucked, tucked in the back corner or something. I don't know. They don't need to be accessible. Only one chest needs to be accessible. Let's have a look what I need to put into the recyclers. Um, copper scrap seems to be the big one, but uh, let's do plastic and iron scrap because obviously the civil recyclers can only do those. I'll add bunch to that one. I am still kind of getting through all of the scraps and not backlogging any of it, not like stockpiling any of it. I may stop doing that just so that it'll stop um, bogging my inventory up pretty soon though as well. So I think our next little part of the plan should be to go over to the the hand in for the tower pieces. So where am I going for that? Let's see. Do I just need to put them down or do I need to hand them in to somebody or what do I need to do? I need to install them apparently. So I guess we're going over to the water tower and we're gonna pop them in. And then everyone will, everyone will clap. <laughs> and then everyone clapped. Is that a little, oh, it's a little macchiato. Hello. Hello, macchiato. I'm meant to be building a water tower, but I stopped to yeah. give this to you. Because I love you and you're so cute. Banjo. I would like to give this to you because you are also so cute. Deputy Captain, I would like to give this to you because you are also kind of scary looking. Yeah. yeah, also liking the opals. So next time we're out in the desert, I'll try and get some more. Because that is that is the way to the cat's hearts. Also fangs. Fang really likes them. Oh, Mian's over here helping out. And everybody clapped. <laughs> well you done, Sheila. Did and a Mian. mighty fine job once again. Just in time, too. I believe our next shipment of water is scheduled to arrive tomorrow. Our town owes you two our gratitude. Commissioner, you really ought to handsomely reward these builders for their efforts. Uh, right. <laughs> I'll add that to the tab as well. That's totally gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Oi, where's my reward? Well, well, bang up job on the uh, water tower, I must say. You know, it's funny. When you and Mian got here, I bet old Mason the two of you wouldn't last a week. Luckily, he's so far off by now, I doubt I'll ever have to make good on that bet. <laughs> now, uh, where was I? Ah, that's right. You did such a good job of following orders that I've decided on behalf of the Commerce Guild that you deserved a bonus for all your what? hard work. Here's the amount promised by the city and 50 goals on top. <laughs> that's right. Oh my all goodness. For you. Don't spend it all in one place. Bye-bye now. 
I don't think you could get one water from Burgess for that. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! That was some stuff. Well, it'll be interesting to see that slowed down. Um, okay, so what happened there? Burgess became my friend, which caused Chi to become my friends. Mian still isn't my friend, though. Ah, interesting. I think my relationship with Mabel just went up to Buddy. My relationship with Yan just went up to Buddy. My relationship with Fang just went up to Buddy as well. So we might start to get some more Fang quests if we're lucky. And Vivi is my buddy now. Matilda's still my associate, as is Macchiato, but Macchiato's close now. I really do want um, Jan, Miguel, and Matilda because I do find them harder to make friends with. So I do want them to be my friends. Pablo, I would like to start trying once I'm not in a position where I'm making a hundred million things a day. Try making hair dryers and curling irons and seeing if he likes any of them. Uh, I will continue to do commissions for Jensen. I will continue to give the seeds to Coco. Pebbles, I'm hoping their parents will drag up in popularity with me until I can maybe work out something he likes. And Sandy is getting there. I think I just have to talk to Sandy. I got a plus three just from talking to Sandy the other day. So that wasn't too bad. Hello, me account. Oh, only a plus six for the chromium ore today. Maybe we should start on the nickel ore. Start changing them up. I did get a piece of nickel ore recently in the mines. Right then, now let's head back and see what's been made in the workshop and things. And if there's any like outstanding missions that are new. I don't think there are. No. So, we need to find telescope pieces. We need to wait for the mysterious man who will turn up around the 20th. It is now the 15th, so in five days' time. I've had to wait a long time for that one. We need to find and defeat Bogan Jack for the third time. And we still need to build the time capsule, but I can't do that right now, unfortunately. So, out of all of those, the only things I can do is go look for Bogan Jack and also do telescopes. So, there we are. Um, oh, petrified wooden boards too. Okay, I have enough for the mission, that's fine. Petrified wooden sticks, I need another three. We're just waiting on those for another three minutes. And then I can hand everything in at the same time. The soup pots have done two out of five. There'll be another five minutes. So if I come back in like five minutes and I work on that, I can ha probably go to the Blue Moon Saloon and hand three things in at once. See if I could take a bloodstone for one. No, still too many commissions. See, Rocky and Crystal are wanting cast iron nails, so if I can get enough for that, that'd be cool. Right, uh, I think we're going to go to... What? I can... Oh yeah, of course I can hand one of them in, can't I? But we're not going to do that. We're going to go out to the desert, and I am going to go and quarry more graphite, because I'm definitely going to need more iron and, and things like that, so... We need to go out and quarry, and we can also get opals, and we can also look for Bogan and Jack. I think that sounds like a good plan. I'm not sure about looking for telescope pieces at the moment. I'm still kind of like uh, wanting to find all the relics, you know? I know that that one's for a quest, but... I don't know. So... I want to quarry these things. I don't know whether I also want to get some plastic. Or you. Come here. I have learned about thorny jumpers and they have coarse leather. So people were telling me that would be a good that's a good way early game to get a bit of coarse leather if you need it for certain commissions. really good about being such a high level on my workshop so early. I feel like it's early game for it. 
lapis lazuli. Now that is something that is needed for a lot of upgrades. And I'm really hoping that it'll eventually take over a little bit from all the fluorite I need because, oh, it's a pain upgrading things with fluorite. If, la if lapis can be directly quarried, then that's gonna make it a lot easier. Oi, he ran away. I love that they have little tails, it's very cute. graphite do I have now? Sixteen. I do need to keep going a little bit longer, but I, I want to go find Bogan Jack. I think it would be fun. Come on, let's see if we can find him. Run around. Also, I want to see if, like, there's any other places I can put in um, Yakmel stops yet. Or whether we're not allowed to yet. See, people were saying, like, it's weird how there's, like, penguins and things in the desert. So they've decided that, like, these are, these are snowy areas in winter. This is why. This is actually the cold part of the desert. The rabbit. This place is not that big, so we will be able to find him definitely. I think I already did. I think this is him here. Because normally the 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 way to chat to tell is that the normal ones don't stand still. They, they sort of roam around. Stay. So Bogan Jack Die. stays still. So you've come. The final battle. The black wind Boy. blows. It calls for your demise, mate. Here's Boy. my reward. Yeah, I've got your reward right here, mate. Getting bashed. I didn't even have my sword in my hand. Breakpoint. He's a lot more tanky this time around, didn't he? I managed to get my gun out. You're not getting me with that stupid attack. I feel like it's a fair fight if I take healing, but if I have to, I'll have. I have to. I kind of feel like I probably would have been nice uh, if I had. Sword and shield. Okay. Really just like his red thing. What he does. Okay, 
I didn't want to have to do this, but I'm going to have to take a heal, I think. Uh, do I have any hemo start? Yeah. I usually have strong medicine as well. Hemostat will probably be enough to do it though. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Oh, shucks, you're right there, mate. Yeah, I might have gone a bit overboard there. Well, if you ever want to regain your lost honor, because I know you would, you know where I'll be. Yes, I want to try again right now. I had some vintage pistol. annoying at the moment. I've lost an awful lot of... I'm losing so much health to him. I'm getting really annoyed by this. I feel like I need to upgrade my um, sword and shield before I go for him again. I was close last time as well, but I don't have any strong medicine or any, any good healing either. I'm getting a bit annoyed with myself now. I feel like that should have been an easy task, but maybe I'll let him take me out so I can have another go. Like the gun doesn't work at all. He's too, too swift. Anything that can help me out. Any food or anything like that. Mm, not really. I was much higher level last time I tried to take this guy on and had much better gear, so it doesn't surprise me it's a little bit more of a difficulty. I'll try one more time. And if I can't do it, immediately into his red rage thing. It's annoying. It's annoying that he goes so far back when he's broken though. I get the brakes on him and then he like is halfway across the map. or I don't get him. I think I'm going to head over to uh, Fangs. I know where he is now, so that's cool. I'm going to head over to... I'm going to upgrade my um, sword and shield, firstly, to uh, iron. Or buy a new iron set off of... Um, I very much expect that Hugo will have a set for me. 
Uh, then I'm gonna come back and give him another try. And I'll go to Fangs as well and get some stuff to help. Do I have, did I get a combat point though from doing all of that? Potentially. Well, like I said, I was about level 50 the last time I tried to take this guy on. And I actually think that the point I'm getting it now is much better because he's actually a challenge. It does feel a lot nicer. The other thing I could do is uh, work on putting some furniture in my house if I really still can't get him. But I definitely will be able to. I just need some better gear and better uh, healing stuff. Oh, no, it's a workshop point. Oh, okay. I'll um, take more fuel. Nah, what should I take my bag slot? Actually, let's have a look. So how many bag slots do I have right now? I have. Page three is full on the first line. Okay, so if I take that point in bags, do I then get extra bag slots let's see two three yeah you do you actually get the the full-on uh slots unlocked for free so that saves a bit of money doesn't it yes it does considering there's i'm getting to the point now where the points aren't worth a lot but i am really running out of inventory space so it's like okay cool So I could quarry a little bit more graphite or I could come back tomorrow with my new sword and shield. A bit of new gear, maybe a bit of new stuff in the house. Although I just put a masterpiece painting in the house to give myself an extra 80 hit points and I did nothing against that guy. But like I say, I was close the first time, but I think my concentration then started to lapse a little bit. So I'm going to go and see if I can get some strong medicine from X. Not X, from Fang. I'm sure X is involved in the making, but... Fang probably does most of it, being the doctor and all. But I can hand in these big commissions now as well, which would be nice. But yeah, I think we'll go back to Bogan Jack in the morning. I think I'll spend a little bit of time just up, up. Oh, did I take the soup pods? Let's see. I should put some soup pots ready for Grace as well. Right, so lots of commissions ready to hand in. Just in time. Okay, so Mr. Owen, I'm really sorry I couldn't do your Blue Moon Saloon stuff earlier. Hello. But... Fish porridge? <laughs> yeah, sure. Tell me about it right now. Lovely. Thank you so much. Okay. Side drop commission. Thank you. Side drop commission. Thank you. I feel like I'm getting further with commissions than I ever was in EA. It's, it's kind of weird. I feel like I've done more towards upgrading my workshop at this point than I ever had in that. I feel like I was only ever getting the four star commissions then, not five star ones. So I don't know whether the commission structure has changed a little bit for full release. Uh -huh. Okay, so I guess Logan thought taking out that water tower would be the end of us. Didn't take you builders into account though, did he? We really did luck out with you two. I mean, if we still had made, just had Mason. <laughs> yeah, that could be a All right, catch you next time. Rare pumping pipes. There's only two of them, though, so it's not so bad. <sighs> I didn't realize they were rare again. And yes, I know how to check. <laughs> Every time I get, like, someone in the comments, by the way, you can check. <laughs> like, I know, I just didn't do it. And I forgot again. So, to build the time capsule. I don't have, that's all of my commissions in though, so I should be able to take more. Because it still seems like I'm aiming towards uh, an increase in my workshop level. 
It really does seem that way. Which is kind of crazy. But if I can take all of the planting ones and all of the nuts and bolts ones, that would be kind of cool. So I'm going to take the bloodstone cores. I'm going to take the cast iron nails. I'm going to take the other cast iron nails. Or am I going to take something like... Oh, I could take... No, I won't take the ones for Zeke today. I'll take cast iron nails for Rocky as well. Oh. So do I still need to take that other one for taking more commissions at a time then? Because I don't have any... Oh, Grace's soups! Darn it! I put... How come I... Did I have it filtered? I must have had it filtered. I was there thinking, oh, I've got nothing. But I've got all of this. <sighs> Grace's soups. I would like to take all, all of the commissions today. That I can. I would like to be a busy bee. Right. Is Grace in the kitchen? No. Where is she then? It would help if I tracked the one I was actually trying to hand in, wouldn't it? Oh, she's up at the apartments, which means she might be in her room, which means I don't know if I'm buddies enough with her to hand it in. Which is annoying because she was probably like, right, oh no, 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 she's on her way, I'll catch her, I'll catch her before she gets to her room. I might have to go into the apartments themselves. Nope, haha, <laughs> caught you. Mm. Nice work on the water tower builder, I wonder what Logan's next move will be. We've shown we don't go down easy, whatever sympathy he might have garnered before, haha, <laughs> well. There's your Thanks. Pot. Very welcome. Didn't entirely mean to go in there. But that'll do for me today, I think. So I need to get some cast iron nails going. Um and I'm also needing to work on that little um, time capsule box thing. And I need to work on what I want to take with me. I don't know if I could put... If I've got any duplicate relics, I could put a relic in there or something maybe. Or a tool or something like that. Okay, so the next thing I want to look at is... Obviously for Bogan Jack tomorrow. I want to be making... Uh... Oh, right, okay. I think I would need to have built the machine for that. Okay, in the morning then. In the morning, the first thing we'll do is we'll go over to Hugo and I'll buy myself a set of... Um, I'll buy myself a set of sword and shield in iron. And then I'll go over to Fangs and I'll buy myself some stuff to help me fight. And then maybe that will be enough. Probably just Hello there. Oh, I've heard Hi. all about you. So glad to finally meet you face to face. I'm Trudy, the mayor of Sandrock. Nice to meet you too. Anyway, I just wanted to come by and introduce myself since I just got back in town. We don't get a lot of new folks, so I'm mighty glad you're here. I'd also like to extend an invitation to the next fireside on Sunday. We've got a lot to talk about. No doubt you've heard about what Logan's done. You seem to be adjusting quite well to Sandrock, and we're happy to have you. See you around. Any commissions, town business? Oh, um, commissions? I hadn't checked on any of that yet. <laughs> I'll have Matilda in the church fill me in right away and get back to you. Okay. Trudy's so cute, especially like, like early game she's so so nervous um actually there is one small thing i guess i could use help with although i'm, I'm sure you're very busy what is it you don't need to trouble yourself too much with this but uh, i do need a new desk at city hall 
It seems Matilda took a liking to my old one and uh, made off with it. <laughs> a, she's meant to be like an ethical like church person and she just stole something. B, you let her get away with that. I'm sure she'd give it back if I asked, but uh, perhaps it would just be easier if we both had nice desks, don't you think? So if you do get time, it would be quite nice of you to help me with this minor thing. Thank yeah, you. I mean, it's I suppose maybe you want the new desk, but like if I were you, I would be like marking my territory. That's what you need to do, Trudy, because you are in charge. I'd be like, uh, excuse me, my desk. So Ryan uh, has given me a simple chair. Oh, thank you. Made it himself, which he doesn't normally do work, so that's really nice. Uh, Sheila, I heard from the professor that there was a terrorist attack in Sandrock, something about the water tower being blown up. My heart skipped so many beats when I heard that. I was so, so worried for you. I didn't know you were okay until I read in the Tumbleweed Standard that no one was injured. Later, I found the courage to tell your ma about it. I didn't want her to worry. She told me everything's going to be all right, that you're strong. But I could tell beneath that calm demeanor she was really worried, since this bandit is still out there. I didn't sleep a wink at night. Sorry, the night I heard the news. I kept having images of the water tower running through my head, burning, running through my head. I decided then and there to go to Sandrock and see you with my own eyes. What? To make sure you're okay. I already asked for a leave from the botany school and the board train ticket. If all goes well, I should be there around two days after you get this letter. Can you pick me up from the station? Pretty please. Um, that would be a bit mean if I didn't, considering how close to my house the station is. Oh, I changed my hairstyle a bit. So attached is a new photo. I don't want to get that scene where you walk past me on the train platform not recognising your long lost friend. I'm excited to see you. Your friend forever, Nia. Aw, oh, that's Nia now. Her hair's a lot blonder than that in real life, though. It's like not quite as ashy looking. Nia is coming to town. Right, so I've got some things that I can pop into the recycler. I'm getting lots of stuff out of the recycler. This is a, a good little deal for me. I'm gonna start doing the thing where I get 13 of a thing before I recycle it. I think that's gonna be better because my inventory is causing issues right now. So let's see what scrap I have. And pop it away. Why have I got tailoring stuff in my scrap box? I don't know. It is starting to get better. No, it's all stone and wood, isn't it? Stone, wood, and rubber and plastic. That's gonna need to get um, very much, very much sorted out soon, though. Yeah, I want to keep the gold on me, though. I'm gonna give a wooden storage to Sandy the Camel. Someone said that Sandy the Camel liked that. I don't know, uh, or I could be wrong. I think someone did. Oh look, I do have a processor in there. So when I uh, upgraded the processor, I got the processor back again. So that's, yeah, that's consistently been happening since I think the last hotfix. Now I know in the last hotfix I did have a look through, they didn't say they'd fixed anything about giving back the originals when you do an upgrade, but what they did say was that you need, uh, that you, they were playing around with something to do with the interfaces on the machine, so I don't know whether they've introduced a bug or whether this is something that they always thought should have been the case. I'm really not certain. I'm not going to worry about it. If that's the way the game is, that's the way the game is. And if they change it, then then that changes it. No, it doesn't really worry me which way around they do that. Whatever they think. Uh, I've got a load of wood and plastic, cast iron rods. Fibre mesh is probably a tailoring thing. Because it's fibre. 
a few things I could be planting as well. Okay, well, we're down to one page worth, so I think that's enough sorting out for now. Ah, nice. The tea and coffee tree is ready to harvest again. And yes, we are getting little bits of increase each time we do that. So eventually this will... And without... I think the thing is, because I don't have to get new seeds and I don't have to like worry about anything with it, I think that's why you don't get such big increases. You do get increases as it as it produces fruit. Uh, but it's not quite the same as these guys over here that are already like level 3 when that's still stuck at level 1 on sandy soil. So, you know, we'll, we'll keep going with it and it will eventually level up. But if I want to level up soil, I'm better off not planting a tree on it because it's faster other ways. Okay. What we got today? Plastic pipe. I think I might have quite a lot of that. see already green backgrounds so they should all be okay hardwood stick oh okay Nemo I want you to go and dig please so that... mostly so you love me it's mostly so you love me okay so I need a bit of leather In fact, I'm just going to untrack some of my commissions. I, I do need the pumping pipes. Sadly, for me, they have to be rare ones. Um, and for that, I need one piece of glass and eight rubber rings. Okay. I don't have enough rubber for that. Okay, good to know. We're going to be going and digging up rubber today. I'm hoping that there is some. Kind of nice not to have some like massive project to, to do at the moment. I've got a bit of tiny bit of respite before my next massive project. Because that took so many materials, especially with the extra commissions I had for it. Um lungfish. I don't even know where I would find lungfish or how I would get them. Uh, so I'll probably try and take the cantaloupe and sand rice ones if I can and get some Zeke points. Uh Zeke's harder to get points with than Arvio, I think, as well. Right, let's go over to uh, Hugo and just see if I can make myself. Otherwise, I need to make a forging machine, which I don't Whatever really want say. to have to do right now. Spread the good word, folks. Let's see. Ah, no upgrade yet. So I am going to have to make a forging machine if I want better equipment so that I can beat. Uh, Mr. Hmm. Yeah. Bobby Jack. I could probably do it. What can a humble like? saloon owner do? Hey, how you been? Not getting tired of the builder life, I hope. All that diving and adventuring. Not for the faint of heart, is it? No. <laughs> no, no, I'm not trying to butter you up. But, uh, coincidentally, there is a little something I could use your help with. What? Build a help? No. I heard from a friend in Atara <laughs> that there are a lot of nasty rumors oh. about sand rocks circulating in that city. Some of them are really out there. They say at night packs of roving monsters roam the deserts by the hundreds. They say us town folk are a wild bunch, always at each other's throats. They say people out here are fighting each other for water. I mean, there's a grain of truth in some of that. There is, yeah. But for the most part, isn't that just the most malarkey you've ever heard? It's very exaggerated, let's put it that way. So, you know me. I came up with a plan that in one fell swoop will not only dispel these nasty rumors, but will also bring in some more visitors. I'm talking landscape photography, baby! Okay, well this isn't something I've had before. We can take some nice landscape photos around Sandrock to show people what really goes on around here. Then I'll send these photos to my friend and he'll get them published in the Atara Times. Once nice. people see how nice it is here, 
I reckon all those rumors will have no ground to stand on and just fade away on their own. Uh, what do you think? Can you help me take some photos? No problem, leave it to me. Great! Uh, here's a list of the spots I was thinking would look good in the newspaper. Come on back when you've taken the photos. I think I gotta clean some grease out from under the oven. Hey. Also, yeah, I, I like to lead by example. Uh -huh. as well. Yep. I feel bad about the last time. In fact, uh -huh. I can just give you the, the the ones that I got last time. Oh and yeah, hand in. that's so me. I'm real righteous uh -huh. like that. Yeah, <laughs> I feel I feel like um, vindicated now. <laughs> do unto others before they do so. unto you. Mabel, here you go with whatever well, it is hello. you want. A new water tower's piece of work. You should be proud. It's a little, a little taller, ain't it? I can see it from the ranch. Coop's a bit jealous of the makeover. Now he wants to change all our fences into metal too. Logan proof, as he calls it. But they'll just get hot and burn in the yakma, won't they? Like the one he insisted I made out of bronze. <laughs> Meat bun? Yeah. I'm gonna have so many. By the time I actually get cooking up and running, I'm gonna have so much stuff. Oh, yeah. Thank you. 12 plastic clips. Don't know what you need them for, but enjoy. I'm off to make a forging machine. <laughs> I need to pop on some um, steel bars as well, and then I need to uh, sorry pop on the nails, and then I need to go and get rubber. Um, so nails are a grinder thing, are they? Yeah, sadly. I need ten for the mission. Have I taken two missions? Oh, maybe I hadn't actually. Maybe I couldn't. Pumping pipes. And uh, bloodstone cores times four. Right. I can make two, and then I need some more bloodstones. I need another five. Okay, we'll have to get five bloodstones. And then I've apparently got to go take photographs. Poor Owen. We like Owen, so we like to do things for Owen if we can. I got two and I got a bonus one from my points, which is rather nice. I do like it as you progress, it starts to get a bit easier to do these things. So that should be enough from just those couple of rocks. For me make the other two good stone cores. Hopefully that should be Amira's mission done. Lovely. Then I need to go get some more rubber. So I'm going to head out down to where the hardwood lives. I don't think I'll need to get hardwood from down there because if I'm getting a lot of petrified wood quests. Could have sworn the horse was going. Oh, it went the other way around the fence, didn't it? How strange. This, this stable is just not happening, by the way. <laughs> I'm trying. I really want to, like, put doodles into the barn as well, but that's also just not happening either. So we're just gonna, like, try our best. The water tower was a huge project. And I got it done relatively quickly, I feel. Considering all the upgrades and bits and pieces that went into having to do it. Like, we had to upgrade this to intermediate. The assembly table had to go to intermediate. Um, I had to get the civil processor up to civil. The grinder had to be up to civil. A lot of stuff had to happen. So let's um, throw some rubber scrap in. Was that rubber scrap? Yes, it was. Nice stuff. Got some rubber scrap. They, uh, actually, if I want it to go a bit faster, I should probably put it in the civil recycler. I think it's got a faster work speed. I also do need to sort of try and get some of these, like the civil processor, the uh, the grinders, 
that are not uh, already rare. I want to get them up to rare if I can. Same with all the furnaces. That would be nice. One thing, if you are getting the original back every time uh, with upgrading, I don't. Again, I don't know whether it's an intentional thing or not. But if you do, the, the, then what you want to do is choose your, your highest level one and upgrade it all the way from being the highest level one. Although I imagine they're easier to upgrade at lower levels. So what have we got to hand in? Amira's commission. So we'll do that first. And then maybe take a look at Trudy's desk. I've got a few things I need for that one. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Amira's birthday. My younger and Sorry, younger brother and I sometimes would have a joint birthday celebration in Barnarok. His birthday is the 6th of autumn and mine is the 11th. Mm -hmm. Perhaps I'll make something in the shape of a new water tower, or rather the tank on top. Could make a refined teacup that shows off the spirit of Sandrock. In any case, thank you for setting our hearts at ease with your punctual reconstruction. Oh, thank you. Sure. And there's my pay, and it looks like Amira just became my buddy. So, like, everyone is just really coming up in in their like of me. It's so nice. I'll go say hi to Katori. Hmm? My birthday is the 16th of autumn. Yeah, don't remind me. Ah. I panicked bought a bunch of water at a high price through the, an outside source of mine. Now you fix the water tower. I wonder if I can cancel the order. Oops. Making things hard for poor, poor, poor Katori. So I need some leather. And some more leather. So I need one, two, three pieces of leather and I can just make all the stuff for Trudy. Let's do it. Let's not do it. <laughs> it was like failure after failure, wasn't it? But we want to go to TaylorMade. The horse can sort it out itself. Okay. So three pieces of basic leather. And back we go. I wonder how far it is before Macchiato is my buddy. I want another pet. Really close, actually. I'm going to see if I can find Macchiato with an opal in a minute. There can't be too many more gifts before that happens. Uh... Right, office chair. And working. Working desk. I thought I bought enough leather. Clearly not, so I clearly need another two. <laughs> oh well, not a big thing. Just a slightly annoying thing. I thought I thought I needed three, but I obviously needed five. I can't count. Okay, that's enough to do that. Let's see if we can find Macchiato at all. Okay, I'll say banjo. Either of them will be fine. Right, Macchiato, you also apparently like rose stone, don't you? But I don't have any any of that on me right now, so you'll just have to make do with opals. Oh, Macchiato's on the bench today. Oh, so far I've managed to avoid doing that. You have to wait until interact shows, otherwise you end up sitting on the bench instead. So, yeah. Macchiato became my buddy. So, now that's happened, I need to make a little animal house and then Macchiato can live with me. Let's see what I need for an animal house. Actually, on the way past, I'll uh, get the leather for the bench. 
I have a feeling leather is needed for the animal house as well, so I'm just going to buy all five. That might save me some time. My throat is scratchy today. I think you can get like animal beds for some of the animals to live inside as well, but uh, I think I'm happy enough at the moment with the animal houses. I couldn't find where the animal beds were. I oh, someone was saying maybe you could buy them at Heidi's place? But it looks like I can just build one, so that's what I'll do. Uh, I think I might want to move the blender. There's actually a bit of room next to the drying rack there. It'll give me a little bit of uh, space to put that extra animal house down into. And then we can go get Macchiato to be pet number two. Of course it's the wrong way around. Of course it is! Let's make Trudy's. If we're going back and forth, I may as well make things on the way. So let's make Trudy's desk. Uh, the pumping pipes, I can make one. Uh, I can't make the time capsule yet. Still don't have the chromium. Some of the nails now. Um, do we have enough rubber to make? I need to make some more rubber rings, I think. So for another pumping pipe, I need four. I can make two. Let's just see if there's any more rubber scrap stuff here. There's a little bit. Not great. I think I can add one more on. And then I need one more piece of rubber. I should be able to have just enough to make the pumping pipes this time. But whether I'll have enough to upgrade them, I don't know. Hardwood sticks. Uh, switchboards are a pain. Cast iron nails. Antelope physique. Okay, that's too many now. It's fine. I'm taking a lot of the commissions off the board that sometimes they stay there a couple of days, but now they're all just getting taken. I'm gonna run out of actual commissions on the board if I'm not careful. Okay, let's go and adopt Macchiato and give Trudy her desk and her chair. great is this? Like, just on the water tower and I've got two pets adopted. I feel like I'm doing so much better with, like, the intermediate stuff. Oh, thank you. I've got lots of things to do, so I'd better get started. Welcome. And then where is Macchiato gone? That's the question. Would you like to sleep somewhere better than that, little cat? Macchiato is now adopted. Running back home. <laughs> Running to their to their animal house. So cute. Jasmine wanted something, didn't she? Is she over here? Or is that Justice? Oh no, Unsure wants something. Okay. What do you want? What is your heart's desire hmm? today? If you guys could construct a water tower that's Logan proof, why didn't we just make everything in town Logan proof to begin with? I didn't know that it's Logan proof, hmm. to be honest. I wanted to add an opal to my collection for a long time, but I heard they're almost impossible to find these days. Oh well, I'll just learn to live without. I always keep opals. I love it. Thanks so much. Wow, this is it. 
It's that opal, huh? You said there are literally millions of them? Haha, <laughs> what a world would that be? Thanks for being so modest, Sheila. This is a great gift. Okay, and now I need to give an opal to Banjo. Now I only need to give the opals to Banjo. I can give them to Macchiato still. But I can also just send Macchiato out on quest and get four points a day from that. Huh. Apparently I already gave you one. Wow! So it's now the meerkat, Banjo, and Coco, I think? So I think my next pet will be Le Meerkat. And that won't take long. And Banjo won't be long behind. And Coco's got a bit to go still. Fantastic. I don't think that's going to take long at all though. I'm glad that I've taken a commission for Zeke though because it's going to force me to go up to like his area and do things. So let's look at my missions again. So we've got a lot of commissions. The pumping pipes are going to take a while. We're nearly there on the cast iron nails. And the hardwood sticks and also more cast iron nails. So I think I should put some more cast iron nails on. I need to put like another 12 to go. Mm. Then I need hardwood sticks for Ryan's one. And then the pumping pipe, I'm still trying to get through the rubber rings. Um, I still need one more piece of rubber to get that sorted, I think. Yes, there we are. And then I need to stop taking pumping pipe ones. Anything else I needed to do for any commissions at all? Anything for anything? So I did, I've put all the nails on. I've put the wood on. I've got the nails for crystal. And then I'm doing the rubber for the pumping pipes. That's fine. I need to take a few photos in the world. Which we can do next episode. Um, I can't build the time capsule because I don't have the chromium. Uh, I can't find and defeat Bogan Jack until I have a better, slightly better stats, I think. Mysterious Man uh, and Telescope Pieces. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we are going to make... Because I haven't made all the machines at the moment. I haven't made a jewellery processor. And I have not made a forging machine either. The rest of it I think I've made. What, recycler, furnace, solar refinery, generator. I don't have a cooking station either. That's so cooking station, uh, forging machine, and a jewelry processing machine. Don't have any of those. But the forging machine's coming next. Probably followed by the cooking, I would imagine. Copper sticks, metal coils. Marble bricks. Bronze bars. Well. That was good. I'll put that back along the fence line, I think. I'm trying to leave um, room to maybe even tuck the uh, assembly table behind so I can have things like stables and things to hold animals in. So one of the reasons I didn't want the the uh, dew collectors is they take a lot of space that could be taken up by other things and I can get the water other ways. So 50,000 goals. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll get the, the rare ones and I'll upgrade, uh, sorry, I'll get the upgraded ones and then I will upgrade them to rare on the refiner as well so that they're holding as much dew as possible and making it as fast as I can make it. Oh, I did what I said I wouldn't do. Oh well. Okay, so let's go to my forging machine. Let's see if I can make myself a uh, iron sword and shield. I can if I have one more bronze plate. 
think I can handle that. Only just though. And I think we're out of copper for the bronze as well. I've got a little bit. Probably what my pets are bringing back. And that's it. Macchiato, you haven't been out today, have you? I dig. See you in the morning. <laughs> Nemo's been out digging today, I expect. Yeah. Have a little chat. I'm trying to send them out each day so they get their four points. Then over time, if I'm getting four points a day with them, over time they're going to like like me quite a bit i would imagine so nemo's sat on two paws and macchiato's at, i think they start at one and a half paws when they get their buddy status with you so two paws is probably like friends i guess ish a cute cat with short soft flexible limbs despite its spaced out expression some say it's been a part of many battles oh you're like a veteran macchiato Veteran cat. One more hardwood stick there. What else have I got to do right now? I'm like, I don't know what I've got to do. Other than, I don't want to take photos in the dark. I've not got time to look for like pieces. I just want to get my sword and shield and fight Bogan Jack. That's all I want to do. I want to have another go with better, better gear. Oh, it looks like my water's running out as well a little bit, so let's go and see if I can take any out of the water tank. And then I'll probably need to grab some more very soon. I really do need to get back into the farming, big style. Especially if I'm going to be taking farming quests, which I really think I am now. I'm like really getting into it. I'm thinking we'll get the... If they're still there, we'll do the sand rice and cantaloupe tomorrow and with anything that's new on the board as well. Um, I've got loads of money now as well. The money's coming in so fast. I'm already at 16 grand. I just, just literally spent all my money. Just a minute ago on upgrading the, the yard and now I've got like 16k again. It's 50k for the next upgrade. So it's, I mean, it's, it's amazing. Um, and talking about money, I really don't need to be keeping scrap paper in my inventory. So, off to abandon. Bye. Just gotta be careful I don't do that on anything else. Oh, did I not? Oh, I must have used literally every single one of my tea leaves. venom in there as well actually. Sandworms I keep on me because they're good for fishing. I'm sometimes asked for that. Um, toolboxes that need opening. Seeds that need to go away. Fertilizer. Yeah, getting there a little bit more each day. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to want yakmel milk in there right okay we're getting to a point now where it's overly full it's stuffed so i'm gonna need probably to move um like cooked food into its own thing so that'll be something i'll do when i get the next three boxes from the mysterious man uh, people are saying as well look out for the large box recipe because apparently he sells it i haven't seen that so far i would have thought that'd be something i would notice but maybe not I don't always notice everything. But they're also saying check that I don't already have it. Wooden storage. I don't see large wooden storage. So I'm thinking... That... Maybe I'll be able to pick that up the next time he comes to town. Along with the... Along with the quest I have to do. But I, I think that's going to be it now. I think we just need to wait for things to process overnight. Uh, oh, I need to make sure that I've got enough energy going into my furnace. That runs out quite fast. So I could maybe do with a second one. But yeah, two pets already. How good is that? I am so super stoked about that. 
So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you all next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome. Thank <laughs> you.